Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. I'm Hashem Ali Khan. Last video, first main problem I have completed. Now in this video, second problem on partnership accounts. Main problem. I'm going to explain. So if you want the complete knowledge, watch all the videos from beginning till end. So in before starting the problem, I expect my viewers to have a printout of the problems which I have given in the link under my description. Always keep ready. Take the screenshot of the points which I have written on the board, then I'll explain every point in detail. See the second problem, <clears throat> problem number two. Ravi and Giri are partners in a partnership firm. Their deed provides the following. So what are the clauses given in partnership deed? The first is interest on capital at the rate of 9% per annum and salary 1000 per month to Ravi and 9000 per annum to Giri. So both the partners are eligible to get salary. Out of the profits made, first 18,000 is distributed in the ratio of fixed capital contributed and the balance in the ratio of 3 is to 2. So after calculating the divisible profit, we have to segregate. The first 18,000 profit will be distributed in the capital ratio, fixed capital ratio. And the balance after deducting 18,000, whatever divisible profit remains, that divisible profit will be shared in the ratio of 3 is to 2. The profits disclosed before this adjustment was 80,000. This is the net profit brought forward from profit and loss account. During the year, the drawings were 6,000, 5,000 respectively. One point you remember, drawings will not be taken in appropriation account. Drawings will be taken in current account. Uh, interest on drawing will be taken on the credit side if it is there. But in the current problem, we don't have interest on drawings. We only have interest on capital. Now, the capital and current account balance at the beginning of the year were capital account beginning of the year, Ravi's capital 1 lakh and Giri's capital 80,000. And current account at the beginning of the year, Ravi 8,000 credit balance and Giri debit balance 3,000. One point you remember. Capital account always shows a credit balance, but current account may show credit or it may show debit balance. The first partner Ravi is having a credit balance, whereas Giri is having a debit balance. You are required to prepare profit and loss appropriation account and current accounts of Ravi and Giri. First of all, we are required to make the profit and loss appropriation account. Credit side. The profit before adjustments that is given as 80,000. This 80,000 is coming from profit and loss account. Debit side interest on capital. The fixed capital are 1 lakh and 80,000. The rate of interest is 9%. 1 lakh into 9%, 9,000 is the interest on capital for Ravi. And for Giri, 9% of 80,000, 7,200. And then salary to both the partners are given in the problem. For salary to partners, Ravi is 1000 per month into 12, 12,000. Whereas for Giri, it is 9000 per annum. So directly 9000 we have to take. That's all. Now subtract this 80,000 minus 9000 minus 7200 minus 12,000 minus 9000. So divisible profit is 42,800. Now this profit will be shared by both the partners in the given ratio. What is that ratio in working notes I have shown? How much Ravi will get and how much Giri will get? So out of this 42,800, 24,880 is the share of profit of Ravi. And 17,920 is the share of profit of Giri. How we got this in working notes I am showing. So Ravi and Giri. First 18,000. It is given in the problem. The first 18,000 will be shared in the capital ratio. The capital ratio is 1 lakh for Ravi and 80,000 for Giri. So it will become 10 is to 8 or simplify. If we simplify 5 is to 4. 10 is to 8 or we can call it as 5 is to 4. So in 5 is to 4, the first 18,000 will be distributed. So 5 plus 4 is 9. So 5 by 9 into 18,000, you'll get 10,000. 
then 18,000 into 4 by 9, you will get 8,000. The first 18,000 distributed. How much is the total divisible profit? 40 to 800. From 40 to 800, subtract 18,000, divide it. So 42,800 minus 18,000, you'll get 24,800. This is the remaining profit. And this remaining profit will be shared in the ratio of 3 is to 2 that is given in the problem. So 3 is to 2 means 3 by 5, 2 by 5. So 24,800 into 3 by 5, you'll get 14,080. 24,800 into 2 by 5, you'll get 9,920. Now you add up 10,000 plus 14,880. 24,880 is the share of profit of Ravi. And 8,000 plus 9,920, 17,920 is the share of profit of Gay. So that's what I have written here. 24,880 and 17,920. That's all. So profit and loss appropriation account completed. Now it is asking you to make the current account of Ravi and Gay. We can make it separate current accounts or in one current account itself, we'll make two, two columns left side. Debit side, two columns, credit side, two columns, Ravi, Giri. Now, beginning of the year, uh, Ravi's current account shows credit balance of 8,000. Ravi's current account is showing credit balance. So by balance brought down, Ravi, 8,000. But Giri's current account is showing a debit balance. So debit side, two balance brought down, 3,000. Opening balance is taken. Now the partners are getting interest on capital and salary. Both these should be taken on the credit side. So here interest on capital 9000 and 7200 already we have calculated here. Right. Salary of the partner 12000 for Ravi and 9000 for Giri we have taken here. These two are the items. Now apart from that the drawings should be taken on the debit side. Here drawing 6,000, 5,000 that is given in the problem. That's all. Now we have to find out the balancing figure, the closing balance in current account. Now if you see the Ravi's account, the credit side it is 53,880. The total on the credit side. From 53,880 minus 6,000 we get 47,880 is the closing balance. Credit balance carried down, here it is brought down. So 47,880 is the credit balance of Ravi. Now Giri's. Giri's credit side total 34,120. From 34,120 minus 3,000 minus 5,000 you get 26,120. So carried down 26,120. So brought down 26,120. Giri's account beginning of the year was having a debit balance. But end of the year Giri's account is showing a credit balance 26,120. That's all. This is the current account. So in this problem, we have prepared the profit and loss appropriation account and also the current account of partners. So inshallah, we'll continue the next problem in the next video.